So on yesterday we had a story that said post hooking is a fraud. Patch him now. Get him out of the game. It takes no skill. All that good stuff right there. Somebody that's a post hooker even came out and tried to expose post hooking. And it looks something like this right here. They, they put out a video that said not only is post hooking something that takes no skill, but he just says right, just straight up right here. Hooks need to be patched. You don't even have to time them. It's auto greens when you hold the stick. And uh, we just gonna play the video right here for y'all. My stretch, I didn't have that have a close shot. Look at hooks. This is how broken they are. You just hold your stick up. You don't even have to let go when it greens. You don't even have to time it. You don't even have to time it. You just go down here and you hold the stick up. I don't have any badges for post hooks. You hold it up. Don't let go when it greens. It greens for you. This needs patched. Now, a lot of the 2K community came out. I put that on the stream yesterday. A lot of people had an issue with it. A lot of people said, uh, just straight up and down, look, bro, y'all had it all last year where y'all could sit there and post, I mean, uh, run side to side, zoom, zoom, with the, you know, get your Mazda on, zoom, zoom, just run from side to side, shoot threes, all of that stuff, and we didn't complain. So let, let, let's have something for the post people right now, man. Let us get our rocks off. We the best people out there. I said, listen, bro, it doesn't bother me either way because you guys play twos. That's only effective on the twos. As a matter of fact, I saw Hollywood play earlier today. He was playing against Quavo Quavo. He post hooked for the first quarter, the second quarter, midway through the third. But when that stamina started hitting him, he ultimately started missing those post hooks and he lost. And on the threes, you know, we're gonna get up, we're gonna get the threes up. So it really doesn't matter to me. They can leave it in the game. Leave it in the game untouched. I got no problem with it. But one thing I can tell you is that uh, you know, it's something that's probably gonna be addressed, it's gonna be patched. It is what it is. At any rate, the boy post hooking was having none of it. He said he gonna fire. He fired back, and he had something to say about it. But before we get to what he what he had to say, make sure y'all like the video, man. Because every time y'all like the video, it helps push out the content that I'm putting out. It lets YouTube know that you guys appreciate the content. More people get to get it. The people that are subscribed to me, they get to get their post notifications and all that good stuff. Sometimes people are saying, "Yo, we didn't even know you put a video up, bro. We thought you just stopped YouTube and all that all together." We're trying to get that out of here. Also. If you're digging the shirt, make sure you check it out. BreezeTees.com, man. Just go over here, bow, check it out. Boom. Pick your color, pick your style, put it in the cart, and you're golden. And uh, last but not least, we also wanted to tell you that we are giving away on Friday this week. We already gave away the copies of 2K. I uh, got to contact the other person that got to get theirs. Don't think I forgot about you. I got you, my G. You hit me up. Uh, you gonna, We're going to send that to you. I got to communicate with you and see if you want the co copy or if you want some VC or whatever like that. So we're going to get that straightened out. Um, also, Friday, we are giving away $50 worth of VC. Whatever that gets you, $50 worth of VC for, for one of the systems. All you have to do to be eligible is like the video, comment down below. You can just comment Jim Star down below, something like that, and make sure that you've commented on all the videos from you know pretty much this week. And uh, other than that, man, let's just get right into the news because every time y'all like the video, it helps us get so clo closer to that also oh coveted 100K. And without further ado, let's get this video underway. Good morning, Dr. in 2K land, man. Listen, bro, the boy post hooking, like we said, he was having none of it. They came for his neck and he said, y'all gotta, y'all best to come with some respect if you're coming for my neck. And so this is what he said right there. He, he deleted the tweet. But ain't nothing never going off the internet, baby. You don't put something out there that you don't want to see again. That's all I'm going to tell you right there. But uh, the, the reconnaissance team here at uh, Gym Stars International, we got that tweet. And here's what it said. Post hooking says, at GV, you are, you are not a smart person. Although timing isn't very hard, there is some skill involved. And he did a video. This was yesterday at 9 a.m. He did the video um, on it. Uh, he had captured his hands, all that good stuff, showing you that he was holding it. Uh, on one of them, but then when he didn't hold it, when he holds it, it didn't go in. Uh, when he when he timed it, then it went in. So uh, also, I think under the GV joint, man, somebody came through. I think it was a uh, post Drew, somebody that you can definitely, definitely uh, trust on this. Post Drew came through with some clarification. He said it's been like that since 21. If there's in, if there's any contest at all, it'll miss. But you play someone small or wide open and it works. And so he came and clarified that right there. So so post hooking has cleared his name. We on the program. We are clearing post hooking's name. We saying that the boy do got some skills. He out there whooping 
rocks. And hey, let him get his flowers for right now, man. They're going, they'll fix it if they feel like it needs fixing. To me, it doesn't matter. I'll never root up against him. And if we and if we get beat by post hooks on the threes, the or the fives, then that means that we just didn't play good defense. We didn't do something well as a team. I'm not worried about it. Trust me, I ain't tripping. Up next, we going around the community to see how some people feel about the game, man. Hey, they the boy elite, not elite shooter. He just said, I dead hate this game. It's horrible. And uh, that's pretty much all he had to say about that. And uh, and then he came down there and the other and you know said something else. And he said professionals, professionals uh what's what's the name? Kaze says professionals adjust and adapt, brother. Have a more positive outlook. The other guards, I mean uh, uh like the other guards, and I promise you'll be fine. He says, I don't know who these other guards, these other guards people that you're talking about, but every guard I've seen. They, that's really tough is saying the same thing and uh you know up and you know i i i ain't gonna say that I mean, well maybe brute just ain't come man because a lot of the people that i'm playing with bro they 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 really aren't saying that like we just we just sitting here and we're trying to figure it out and we're going through it and all of that uh he also said not gonna lie i can't play park or my career lol i'm gonna get a grinder so i can hurry up and do stage streams because career it, this career is not it now i'm not gonna i'm not gonna disagree with you on that one elite i ain't gonna calculate you my boy hey the, the grind for the badges is real to the point where I'm almost about to do what All City said and just make me a rebirth and just, just do the running 2K challenge, make me a rebirth and then just get my stuff and it'll make it a little bit easier because you get 28 badges right off the right off the muscle. But you know, it is what it is, man. It's one of those things where like they didn't want to make it easy and it was like this in 2K20. They did up the badge progression so that you could get bills done faster in 2K20. So hopefully after the first few weeks after everybody gets used to the game we'll see what we got and we'll know what we got but like i said bro right now we don't even know what we got nobody's like literally nobody has people got shooting badges and like t said well i mean what other shooting badges you gonna get to help you hit i just don't i just think we just in for 2k where you're just not going to hit shots like that something like 2k19 when they were complaining about it i remember grinding df complaining about it at the beginning of uh was it 2k19 or 2k20 he's just like bro does somebody come out and hit like like six or six or seven or seven all greens i don't want to hear nothing about the shooting or whatever he was crying about it about about it back then and then you know he adapted adjusted and then he was good i don't know if it was 19 or if it was uh no nah, it wasn't 19 it had to be 20 where he was saying that so you know it is what it is and i ain't saying he crying i'm just saying that's what y'all was saying yeah you know, hey stop crying you know you, you, you miss shots but hey it was it is what it was and then once everybody got badges and stuff we adjusted and the game was a lot easier now 2k20 was one of the harder ones to shoot but if you can shoot you can shoot and so it's probably gonna be the same thing with 2k23 it's just got we just got some uh, adjustments to do because like guard up the hand down man down bads all these uh dead eyes and stuff limitless range a lot of people don't have this stuff yet so once they get it i'm sure it'll be easier to shoot we'll be able to we'll be able to adapt and, and and adjust but if you were just left right made and you was run stop stop run fade all that that stuff is over with so i don't know if you're going to be able to overcome that or adapt y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section the boy yard mind the number one cheese head in the building that's my guy hey the self-proclaimed number one cheese head he said i go to the stage where the cheeses get to it so hey, it is what it is. This is something that he said about the game. He said shooting off the dribble needs to be a little bit smoother. I don't disagree with that. I can tell you this. Shooting off the dribble is tough. It's more like 2K20 where you have to hold it a little bit longer in order to shoot off the dribble. Um, it just it just is what it is. That's why we get. Dribbling is a little delayed. Yep, you can't branch or launch out of moves like you want to. Uh, even Brute said that right down. He one of the nastiest guards on the game right now. I'm not going to lie. Gambit definitely one of the nastiest centers on the game. I'm just out here going for a ride. I'm not going to lie to you. My career progression needs to be buffed. Everybody can agree with that. I'm not going to lie to you. I think everybody... Can't agree with that. Um, my career progression needs to be buff. Cutscenes should should be off or new uh, off on new players. I can feel that because you be trying to get through that, and some of these quests need to be off too, man. It's crazy. It's it's crazy how that is, man. And then also, would uh, we should be able to turn off the quest? And that's exactly what I was saying just now. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, the boy. Yeah, but, hey, listen, bro. You you right there inside everybody head, man. I, I don't think that nothing that you said there is anything that anybody can really disagree with. We want to play games. The badge grind probably wouldn't even be that long, but it's literally interrupted 
all the time by a quest that you gotta do before you can just go play the game. What about the people that just wanna hoop 2K? I know y'all got y'all story stuff and y'all, you know, you want people, you wanna make people explore the city. I, I ain't got no problem with it. We wanna explore the city too, but sometimes you just wanna play like 10, 12 games in a row and get that bad progression popping and you gotta do quests you know, or what have you. I just think the quest should be optional in some uh, in some areas. But that welcome to the league quest, I feel it because I do I do like my badges uh, like it is. So if the quests are not going to be optional, I feel like they should give us a substantial reward. Like I know you can't give us a reward like welcome to the league, but it should be something that we're gonna that we're gonna value or what have you like that. That's all I. I, that's all I can really tell you about that. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. Up next, we got Mike Wong. That boy Mike Wong say, what shot timing are you using? Me, I'm using very early. Uh, a lot of people are using early. I think that's what T using uh, early. Uh, 2K Labs, they did a an in-depth joint. And Mike said, uh, after NBA 2K Lab did a, j a good job explaining uh, the settings here. And more or less, they tell you that the shot uh the shot release deal it doesn't it does not impact the speed of the shot it's just where you let it go and so right here you see the meter is filled more but everybody's going to release the ball at the same time so that might help you out that might not help you but if you understand what i'm saying it just says that you know it says it just puts it earlier it's it just makes it for you to release it earlier. You're not gonna get rid of the ball any earlier. You're gonna get rid of the ball at the same time, but you can just let it go earlier for an earlier green window. Now, we're talking about how some people feel about the game right now, bro. This right here, that boy baiting, baiting pass that, hey man. Jesus Christ, boy, that boy hit that thing with a Hassan chop. <laughs> Yo, he, he really punched clean through the desk, man. That thing is like, Bro, I don't know, boy. I need you teaching uh, my son Taekwondo class, bro. And he said, bro, uh, bro, Derek, what did you do? And he said, got, got far. Hey, man, listen, bro. It, it ain't never that serious, bro. You don't have to be breaking tables and stuff like that. But I do understand what y'all going through. And Don Work said he understand, too. Uh, number one, somebody asked Don Work, are you coming out with a bill video yet? And he says, not yet. Got to get a real feel for the game and my bills before I start giving suggestions. I don't know what I'm doing right now. At least he can admit it. And that's why I'm telling y'all, like, if you're going to do a bill, especially your first bill, do something like what I showed y'all, what Brute showed y'all, what Gambit didn't show y'all and will never show y'all. And what that means is do something that's a very safe bill because the, the bills you're going to have to invest. Uh, uh, you have to invest in your bills. Problem. You have to invest some VC and some time in these bills. So with that being the case and knowing that, I would say, man, make sure that you try to get that bill as close to correct the first time or just do something that's very safe like what I did. Very high defense, very, re very high rebounding. Uh, and, you know, I can shoot the basketball. And people were asking me, like, how you get by with 40 speed with ball? Bro, I don't drill. Like, most of y'all need to have 40 speed. Most of y'all need to have zero speed with ball because you ain't supposed to be dribbling. I'm a lock. I get a ball, I get the rebound, get a ball to my point guard. But if I need to go back door, if I need to go by somebody, I got plenty of clips of me getting on that rim and showing y'all that I can do that. So like, I don't, I'm not the primary ball handler and we don't, I, I don't need to dribble the basketball. So it's no point in me wasting stuff on that. And I think if a lot more people thought like that, you have a lot more balanced bill and you'll be good to go. Up next, the boy down work came back and he just said, it's funny watching everyone trying their hardest to cheese the dribbling. Dudes, dudes do left, right, or find some, uh, dudes do a left, right, or find some little glitchy, uh, glitchy launch and call themselves moving. No, you're ass. I probably, <laughs> I promise you, you're hustling backwards trying to cheese this one, but I'm gonna let y'all rock. And that's how I feel about it, bro. I'm not saying nothing about what people are doing. I want y'all to play the game how you want to, enjoy the game, and do all that stuff, man, because that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna enjoy the game, I'm gonna play the game, and we're gonna figure out what you can do and all that other stuff. But like people out there literally only trying to break the game, you're in for a rude awakening. I'm not saying that they won't find a way to break it, but what I am saying is there are so many safeguards in to keep that from happening this year, that is gonna take you a very long time. Just like Limitless Takeoff, you can't get that unless you invest a lot of points, at least 15 points, uh, 18 points probably into, into uh, finishing, stuff like that. 
they put the adrenaline bars in the game because left right is still in the game but you just they realized that well after three of them you know you really can't do anything you can't get an explosive launch and you're done and and even if you do you get open your your uh, stamina is gone and you can't shoot the ball so there's so much stuff in the game that keeps you from trying to cheese it if you're not playing team and then they got team takeover if you do the one more pass and you do team takeover you're gonna get team takeover almost every game so much stuff to kill the individualism and 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 have people play as a team and then you got stuff like this well me and my boy hey look at this first contact lob man uh many more to come my boy my boy came down broadway look at look at right here look we get the ball coming down i got it get up paul get up mother Woo! mother get up hey that paul got up I, hey man this is what we doing we trying to have fun get up and transition contact right the contact rack man so like i said bro it's still ways to have fun in the game i do want people to have fun the way that they have fun but at the same time you got to realize that it's not your right to have fun exactly how you might want to have fun or what have you like that so you know it is what it is hey the boy glad he says first legend we just do it like this hey not first legend first legit level 40 and hey there we go right here boom and uh Bam, and it shows that it does answer the question of what we said. Yes, more than one person can get into the golf court. So if you're going around the city, you can get into the golf court. You can do what you need to do. And uh, you, you can really get busy. The boy Don work, he comes through and he says, I made a guard. I made a bully guard uh, too that also had like 93 ball, but I'm not gonna say too much one grind at a time and then hey, the, they, uh, the power of bully famous enough talking about the power of bully man look at this right here bro. this is insane going down the court set a couple of screens set a couple of screens rolling get off me back up off me just get off me hey look he, he went to the rim right there and our uh, best say stop showing people bruh and it just shows you the power of the bully badge man i don't know if this is one of the ones where the dude just didn't have any type of interior at all or what have you but hey it is what it is and the reason that he's talking about uh the first legit one is because a lot of people a lot of people um a lot of people did get to the 41st but when they got to the 41st they got banned i had that video up here of the dude bro he got he he got to the level 40 and like literally instantly got banned let me see if i can find it real quick for y'all and then i'm uh then i'm gonna let y'all get up out of here man uh because like i said man a lot I, I just don't i just don't understand why so many people are just trying to cheese the game instead of just playing it man it's just like it's like play the game have fun and and try to figure out what you can do but the fact that people are literally only invested in trying to play the game, I mean, in, try, in trying to um, break the game, it just kills me, man. But like, here's that video right here, NBA 2K links and Intel, he put it out there. He said, dude, uh, LMAO broke hit level 40 and got banned instantly. And hey, look, it's just one of those where he was like, I, I mean, <laughs> bro, I don't know if he was cheating or not. I can't tell y'all nothing. I don't know if it's got no music with it or not, but let's see. Yeah, he got he got he got music in it, so I can't play it. But boom! Right there, I mean it is what it is, man. He 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 played, did it, and I guess he wasn't legit because uh, you know, here we go right here. We're gonna just make it big, and it just says uh user account has been bad due to violation of the terms of service please contact customer support if you feel like it was done in error man like i said bro listen play the game straight up man don't go out there try try to try to uh you know cheat the system and all that stuff i just feel like if we just play the game straight up everybody have fun we figure out things along the way and we gonna be good but a lot of people they just literally just try to break the game they ain't trying to do nothing else at all so it is what it is let me know what y'all think down in the comment section give me a uh give me a gym stars on uh give me a gym stars or uh, should i say gym star pull up give me a pull up in the comment section if you made it this far man and i'm holler at y'all next time man till next time <laughs> it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's town